Hey, what's going on guys? Evan from Model3D. And I apologise for my lack of videos of, over the past week or so. Um, I haven't been very well, and no one wants to see me coughing and spluttering through videos, so I decided to take a little break, but I'm back, and I've got a nice little unboxing for you, so let's get to it. So as you all know, I'm a big fan of Kickstarter. I back everything I see and I like, which is cool. Um, today I received another package from Kickstarter. This is the Pine 64. Um, inside the pack, I also got a um, power extension lead, like a little 5 volt um, power lead for the um, Pine 64, obviously. So I didn't have to go out and source one, go to the shop and try and find the right one. Um, and I also bought a little wireless um, dongle, you could say, a little wireless chipset kind of thing to go on the board. And in the package also came. Let me find it. This tiny little thing. Tiny, tiny little thing. They just threw it in the bag, which was really strange, because it's just a bag. And they just threw it in, but basically it's an on and off switch that was um, an extra given to you, which is cool. So I'll put that on, but let's have a look what's in the box. So it's nice packaging, nice kind of simple packaging with the Pine64 logo, um, Innovation Awaits, um, Open Sesame, it was sealed with a sticker, and then obviously some information and warranty, that kind of stuff on the bottom. And this is it. That's basically all it is. What it is, if you don't know, is um, basically like a Raspberry Pi kind of thing. It's like a, a chipset board, like an all-in-one kind of computer kind of thing. Um, there's three different options. There was This is the one gigabyte board. There was also a 5, 12 megabyte and a 2 gig. Um, it's got everything on it. It's got um, like an Ethernet. Uh, you got your HDMI out. you got your little power jack. Um, all your I.O. pins, I think they're called. Um, two USBs, um, obviously headphones, that kind of stuff. Um, you put your, if I can find it, yeah, you put your uh, memory card in that one, obviously to give it memory, um, and you upgrade it with your wireless device on here and all that kind of stuff. Um, I don't know too much about these kind of things, so I can't go in depth with like which components on which. I know it's got the A64 chip, but that kind of means nothing to me. Um, but yeah, the, the whole purpose of me buying this was for my one head duplicator i3. I'm going to install AstroPrint on this and we're going to get wireless printing. Um, I'm going to be able to um, watch it from the cloud via webcam. Um, I'll be able to start and stop prints via the cloud and all that kind of stuff. So there'll be a video of me putting Linux on this, um, installing AstroPrint, connecting it to my, my printer and going ahead and printing wirelessly via the cloud, which is awesome. So um, yeah, I hope you like the video. There's not gonna be That's not going to be that long. Uh, if you want one of these, you can pop over to the website down in the link below. Um, obviously, after all the Kickstarter backers have received their pledges, then all the pre-orders or whatever the website's doing will start to send out. So I don't think they're sending them out just yet, but I'm sure you can pre-order or um, get notified when they're available and pick one up. Um, there's also some stuff I'll leave down in the description of this compared to kind of the Raspberry Pi 2 or the Arduino Uno. Um, there's nice little kind of like step-by-step -step things of how they compare like obviously speed. I know this has got a 4k output It's got the possibilities to run off a 4k telly, which is awesome So if you into your kind of old-school games ps1 ps2 you could run an emulator off this um, Yeah, the possibilities are endless. I mean um, people use Arduinos for drones So this could be like a more um, in-depth drone or you could do whatever you want basically so yeah, if you've got one of these, please let me know what you're doing it with it down in the comments. Leave a um, comment down below. Um, please like the video if you liked it. Please make sure to hit the subscribe button if you aren't already. And I'll see you in the next video.